<laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Specifically, right, right. the baby holding the steamer, which okay. is disturbing in and of itself. So we're, I'll, I'll wear this colored suit. All right. All right. <laughs> so, so, hello and welcome to Steaming with Kirsten. Steaming so, with Scott. I'm just reading the descriptions. Right. Well, so, on a cruise ship, you don't have an ironing board and iron. Because as you can tell with the turbulence we've had today, turbulence... Not turbulence, it's a rough sea. It's a rough sea. Um, things are a little wobbly, a little shaky, back and forth. So tonight is the fancy uh, costume dress night. No, just fancy dinner. Fancy clothes. Okay, fancy Wait, dress in Britain it, means you get dressed up like in Halloween costumes? I almost did that. I wanted to do that. I almost got a dinosaur costume. So but it's we're formal do, night at okay. dinner. And we are we are doing... our We, we, uh, we bought... Stanley here. What you mean we? Well, I bought Stanley. Stanley Steamer. Stanley Steamer. Um, I guess I should turn him up. Yeah, Whoa. it's, it's got to warm up the water. Don't put it by your face! <laughs> and so. Kirsten is going to, now as I am steaming this shirt to try Prior and Prior to steaming it, you should probably hear the safety instructions. All right, Kirsten, <laughs> begin. Steam produced by this device is, wait for it, very hot. Never point the steamer nozzle at people or pets. Do not bring the steamer close to the hand, face, or other parts of the body. So by putting it near your face, you're breaking all the steamer rules. You gone. Do not allow the use of the steamer by children or people with limited physical, sensory, or mental abilities, or lack of experience and knowledge unless they've been trained or instructed the correct use of the device by the person responsible for their safety. It looks like Stanley is taking the, 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 the wrinkles out of this. What else? All right. Um, as a disclaimer, I did not teach him prior to this, even though I am responsible for his safety on this trip. And to be clear, in the do's and don'ts sections, it shows you not to put the steamer on a cat or chicken. And to not Do let not steam your chicken. No matter how you like your chicken, put it in an oven. Do not use an iQual. Just. And they also have it in the hand of a baby who appears to be wearing long johns, and the baby has a sad face. Just to so you know. We have seen some children on the cruise ship. We will not allow them to steam themselves because they do not. They do not look like the brightest children as their parents are preparing to throw them overboard. Because they're asking a lot of annoying questions. I will say this is working, though. I'm pretty impressed, Stanley. Stanley is working. The steamer is able to steam items in both vertical and horizontal positions. Mm. You can place clothing on a hanger or lie it flat on a heat-resistant surface. We don't then have bring a heat-resistant surface. the steam nozzle right next to the fabric. Move the steamer in a continuous motion back and forth or up and down. Until the wrinkles are smoothed out. Who invented this? Stanley, I assume. Stanley Steamer. It's a multifunctional fabric steamer, according to the... Uh, I gotta say, this is not so bad. I mean, do you think we could steam broccoli with it? Broccoli, maybe some asparagus. As long as it wasn't next to a chicken, I'm sure we'd be fine. Yes, do not steam chickens. <laughs> Whatever you do. Do not steam chickens. No chicken steaming allowed. They have chefs on board for that. And this is the end of your steaming safety precaution video. Any any other tips, tricks, precautions? You sure? We got them all? Stay in there. Yeah, if that falls over, you're breaking the rules. Like my eye. Stay, Stanley. Wow, I got to say. Oh, it specifically references Amazon, so this must be an Amazon product. Oh. Use the hook in the middle of the ceiling. Use the hook in the middle of the ceiling. Maybe that's what it's for. I don't know. I mean, the room doesn't come with a standardized steamer. I'm impressed. The whole new world is opened up. I, I, this is cool. It's hot. I bought one a million years ago, and I don't know where I lost it. Because <laughs> you couldn't steam your chicken. I wasn't allowed to steam my chickens or my cats. 
Oh, I forgot to cover the part the part that it says you can steam uh, stuff there. <laughs> you can steam. Furthermore, thanks to its compact size, it can serve as an indispensable assistant on trips. I make you a bet. You could melt some uh, some snow with this in the wintertime on your windshield. You better have a long extension cord if you're getting out to look out. It doesn't have a uh, cigarette lighter adapter on there. Alright, I think we're done, Stanley. Wow. Do, hot, do not touch. Never use any converters for 110 volt only. Yeah, you know, we're just going to put you back here. You seem to want to do that. It's got to cool down. I might have uh, taped all of this. I don't know. 